Hey, how's it going? My name's Olivia. I'm studying a Bachelor of Arts with an extended major in writing and a minor in journalism and mass communication. And this is my third year of study as well. Hi, um, my name is Tiam. I'm studying English and drama in secondary education. It's also my third year. What's the difference between an academic advisor, a learning advisor, and a student service team? Oh, right, yeah. So I know student services team, uh, in my experience, is sort of like a broader umbrella term where you can go for support. Um, they offer like counselling support. Um, they're sort of who you ring if you need to book any appointments with the counsellor. You can, those can also be booked online, of course. Um, academic advisors are the ones who will help you with your sort of study load and uh, how you want to sort of organise your degree if you're unsure about your program and the direction you're taking. Um, academic advisors, they're all sort of free services of course, so you can book an appointment with an academic advisor and that way they'll help you sort of w work out which courses you need to do exactly, um, determining your career path and that type of thing, so they'll have like a proper full consultation with you. A learning advisor is more for sort of one-on-one -on -one study help if you need study tips on how to like manage your time or sort of uh, communicate with your professors. If you're, they can offer like a little bit of help on like specific assignments as well and help you go through the criteria sheet. Um, but yeah, that's sort of my knowledge of it, I guess. What would you do? Yeah. Um, yeah, I was super confused at the beginning as well. Yeah. <laughs> but once I get sort of appointment with each of the services and kind of clear out what each advisor do and what's their supervision. Mm. Um, so I guess academic advisor will give you more of a degree oriented yeah. advice. And um, for example, you have um, whether you need to finish this course to be able to graduate or um, you want, as if you're an international student, you may have to extend your COE. And also if you meet a language requirement for certain activity or student exchange, those um, orientate. Um, but I think a learning advisor is more of a person who gives you study or assignment oriented advice. Mm. For example, have it difficult to write an essay, yeah. um, you have trouble making public speaking and um, that kind of things. And a yeah. student service, I guess they addressed more of a student daily life if you, mm. you know, so, such as um, accommodations, financial aids yeah. and problems like that. Oh, awesome. Yeah. That reminds me as well, yeah, student services like mm -hmm. includes like the student administration team. Um, so they offer like basic help if you're having issues with my senate or your enrollments, any of those type of like administrative issues. Um, student services also includes, yeah, the admin sort of team as well. Great. Yeah. Mm -hmm.